Hello everyone, and welcome to Rock Studios. I'm Stan Miller, I'm the PR and Analyst Relations Manager for Rockwall Automation in the EMEA region. And I'm joined today by Malte Dickelman. He is our Regional Vice President for Software Sales in EMEA. Malte, welcome to the studio. Thank you for having me. So Malte, we're here today to talk about the business benefits and outcomes with a successful MES implementation. This is a great topic and I just want to jump right in. What are some of those main business benefits when we talk about an MES implementation? Is it greater flexibility? Is it efficiency? Is it all of the above and more? I mean, from your perspective, what does that mean? So let me first start by saying that uh, technology is advancing. So MES by itself is most of the time joined by other topics as well. Many of our customers start advancing with MES projects, but also consider what about IoT? What about AR? What about now just latest technology and latest uh, trend is very much about ChatGPT. So there is so much happening in the market, so much many advan advancements around technology. That's really exciting. But what I keep talking to my customer, our customers about uh, when, when they consider an MES implementation, many of them are still at early stages. Many of our customers, and we should not underestimate that, are still dealing with pen and paper. So it's very much about how they can benefit from technology by getting into a more digitalized way of dealing with their own production environment. And there are different angles where we can start off with, but it is definitely to make sure we can show them there is more in for them to achieve greater flexibility, agility, challenges. Great perspective. Why is having an open-ended approach important when it comes to an uh, MES implementation and, and how is it beneficial? So ideally, when we talk to our customers, when I talk to customers, we have the situation that we start with a single plant, with a single line. And then it's important to figure out where's the start point and the end point. But over time, obviously, these MES implementations will have an impact for the full plant, for mul multiple plants. And this is where it's always important to consider over time what has changes, what are the learnings, what other technologies we might need to consider moving forward. What about technical enablement through augmented reality? What about IoT use cases when it comes to um, measuring operational efficiencies by far better? So there are different angles and different learnings along the way. So I encourage customers when we talk to about that to have an open-ended approach. Don't get me wrong, you need to have a start date and an end date for a certain implementation, but to be agile and benefit from learnings along the way. Makes a lot of sense. When we talk about an MES implementation, how does that help customer diversify their revenue streams? Ah, another interesting perspective. So by using technology to implement an MES system, customers benefit most of the time for, from reducement in scrub, for example. They have more insight about OE and they gain a different level of flexibility in their own, in their own operations. And this frees up a lot of resources, budgets, and also people. And so they can start thinking about allocating those resources differently. And some of our clients even start thinking about how they can transform their own business model to the next level based on their digital transformation journey. And MES is one cornerstone of that, and that makes it so exciting. Malte, when we talk about an MES implementation, where does an ecosystem come into play and how can that affect uh, that entire process? What's your perspective on that? Mm -hmm. As I said, we have, during an MES project, there are so many different items to consider. Take, for example, cybersecurity. We have good partnership with companies like Clarity, for example. When you think about IIoT scenarios, we have good partnership with PTC. And this is where we can turn different angles into action during such a project. And not to forget, how can you scale by using the cloud? Many of our customers benefit from the cloud already, and it's the way to go. And we have a great partnership with Microsoft, which makes, makes it even more exciting to combine different strengths from different partners. And that's what we are proud of, what we can offer and communicate with our clients. It's a great point, Malte. I mean, thinking about it, right? One company can deliver some really important technologies and, and support, but when you bring multiple partners together, potential best of breed, for example, then all of a sudden you're getting a more holistic approach. Um, makes complete sense. Well, Dave, thank you so much for joining us in the studio. It's thank always a pleasure. Me. And thank you for watching. If you'd like to learn more about Rockwell Automation Information Solutions, including MES, visit www.rockwellautomation.com.